Welcome back, guys, to our legacy playthrough of Destiny 1, continuing on with Rise of Iron. Okay, let's move forward. Iron Temple. Wait a second. Was Gallarhorn not available in year two? That's right. This is the year three version. I got a quest for the Gallarhorn, and I was like, wait, what? Huh. Yeah, there's a quest that you pick up for this. So I didn't, I did not remember that. Echoes of the Past. Uh, let's see, it says right there, a noble warrior requires a noble weapon. Prove yourself worthy of the Gallarhorn. That's crazy. Darkness still lurks in the plague lands. This battle must wait. Yeah, complete the campaign, and then we can get Gallarhorn. Absolutely nuts. Forgot that they brought that back in year, in year three. The guardians will learn from Oh, you've got to be kidding me. God. Really need the mantle. This is a very narrow step, by the way. So, like, if you're walking up here, like, and you just have to go... I don't know. That's a weird... Weird design. And then there's stairs here. Why is there stairs here? Why are there stairs on the side here? Whatever. I keep thinking about the Iron Lord's final descent into the Siva Replication Complex. We were so young. So confident in our victory. And yet we lost everything. Hmm. I wonder why his dialogue changed, or doesn't match the, the text there. So con confident in our victory, he's, but it says so confident we could not fail. We've analyzed the data from Clovis Bray, and Shiro has found a way to temporarily disrupt the Splicer's control over Siva. It's time to finish this. Shiro's analyzed the Clovis Bray data. He found a way to temporarily disrupt the Splicer's control over Siva. One way or another, my long vigil is almost at its end, and I have you to thank. Let's finish it. You say that, but... You know, Destiny 2 comes around. You still got responsibilities there, brother. Don't worry about it. Uh, There we go. Mission. This is the Iron Tomb. I think he's talking about his vigil specifically at this... At the, uh, at the mountain. Which, you know, whatever. I get it, but... All the best weapons are from Rise of Iron, right? This is from Eyes, that, that, that. Supercell was a year or two weapon? Siva into their systems. They created a massive network rise, rise, rise. nanotech. Rise, so, rise. Just like they took down our sensor grid, we're going to take down theirs. That should neutralize Siva long enough for you to enter the replication complex. This is where my fellow Iron Lords sacrifice their lives. You must stop the flow of Siva now and forever. No matter the cost. Yeah, some of the best weapons to come to Destiny were because of this particular expansion. So good. So good. Okay, I remembered. There are a lot of this. splicers between you and that replication chamber, Guardian. Stay alert. Those are the hive. Alright, let's get a move on. Man, I'm having major deja vu right now. Just remembering this place. The Splicers have built a fortress to protect the entrance to the complex. Short-sightedly, they decided to use the reactor in an old oil tanker as a power source. That's going to be our ticket. Isn't there an axe somewhere around here? Like up there or something? I think it spawns the public event, maybe. I can't quite recall where it is. Uh oh. Picking up a strong energy signature nearby. That'll yeah. be the reactor. Swapping the fusion cells should knock out the network for a few minutes. Defenses, replication, everything. I think the Fleming Battle Axe appears right there. Right on top of this thing, like during a public event that's in this spot. I don't know if I can trigger the pub public events yet, though. I think we have to progress a little more. God, there's just so much potential to, like, really flesh out this area. God, I want to receive it back so bad. No excuse, Bungie. Bring it back. Bring back, Siva.
Poor little robots. I love how they blow up and they have like that little animation. I think it looks like the Vex animation. Okay, pull the fusion cell and switch it with its counterpart. You first. Oh, damn it. I see that purple, which means there's another servitor around that corner. When we take it, more enemies will probably show up, right? Okay. Tinkering with an unstable Golden Age reactor infected with SIVA. Child's play. Oh, we're okay. We're okay. Wow, that was fast. Maybe, but it won't last. Move, Guardian. The SIVA replication complex awaits. The Iron Lord's original plan was to destroy the replicator in the SIVA chamber. Yolda's explosion apparently only damaged it. So when you reach the chamber, you will need to finish what she began. Come on. That won't stop the Fallen from using Ugh. the SIVA they already There we go. There's more than one battle in a war. Okay, easy, Shiro. We understand you, freaking drama queen. Damn it. There we go. This is such a big area to not bring back to. having some adverse effects. I wouldn't celebrate too quickly. Oh. This is crazy. The Archons keep. This is that spot I think that opens up where you can farm for gear. Reached the replication complex. Dream the worst Eater. Of Rasputin's defenses had already blanketed this entire area. Frames. Dreamweaver. Constructs. Some things I haven't seen before or since. They Archons Forge. Pain. No fear. All we've seen so far is fallen. Wow. This is a throwback. Boom. I'll take all this. Thank you. Last time his presence was almost physical. I think he was trying to communicate, but we did not understand. How can you be so certain Rasputin won't get involved once we're inside? The Vanguard still believe Rasputin to be simply a war mind. He hasn't been that for a very long time. 
Oh, nice. some really great architecture in here we see a lot of this design i think some semi reused maybe in certain like uh lost sectors in d2 but like again it's the grit and the texture and the darkness and stuff that look really great and people have been commenting too on this like being 30 frames per second dude i i can't tell like <laughs> i'm a simpleton maybe i don't know but i can't tell I mean, if they're not going to bring Wrath of the Machine back, make a Siva dungeon. Make it something a little more simple, you know? Like, how hard is it just to create these textures and put it in the world, you know? I don't... I don't know what they're talking about makes it so hard. Whatever it is, I just don't... I don't know. There's a bigger story to that. I think it's just they don't want to... I don't think, I think that would be hard for them because everything that they've brought back has been reused to some extent. And they're, oh shit. The raids are one of those like really expensive, but like worthwhile things to bring back. But the entire, the entirety of ROI has not been reused in any capacity. This portion of the uh, Cosmodrome didn't come back. The raid obviously didn't. No, none, of, none of the strike variations came back. Like, they, there's just no trace of it. So it stands for reason it's expensive because there's a lot they would have to bring back, I would think, maybe? I don't know. So when we stop the production of... Armchair developer. Because it'll be that easy. What about who's controlling it? I have some leads on that. Fallen chatter about some crazy splicer priest who wants to play God. I'm kind of with Saladin now, though. Zealots can take a back seat until the heavy lifting is done. That's a big boy right there. No, I kind of like the idea of using more than one shot. Draw out the fight a little bit. See, like, I mentioned this before, but, like, dude, imagine that you could just stealthily take down everyone in, like with like assassinations dude come on an assassination animation would be amazing you're telling me that you have these incredible like hunters not just like subclass but like hunters stealthy stealthy warriors but you're not gonna like have anything that you do at all involving stealth i guess too though also to like adding to that Bungie side of things it's like the whole game is run and gun most of the content or most of the enemies you can just run right past the replication chamber is beneath you look for a way down like unless there's a phase of something that you have to do that requires you to take down waves of enemies like nightfalls and strikes and and a lot of other challenges you just got to kill the main boss in the room or just run past everyone and can continue i wish it wasn't like that stairs Whoa, I forgot about this place. Wow. I forgot. This place is rad. You are close to Siva's dark heart, young wolf. Be on your guard. This place is rad. I'll run into your little servitor. I think there's a fragment or something over here. A Siva fragment. Oh, there is stuff over here, though. Because you can jump it around over there. Okay. Maybe not a Siva fragment. There's stuff here. Ah. 
we're so far away, I had nothing to track onto, so it's just going straight up. It's still going. Okay, that was just lucky. I don't think I hit that. I think it was popping right when I was shooting at it. Well, let's pretend that was a skilled shot, shall we? over here drop any greens oh you just came out of nowhere didn't you there's some greens I shot right between his legs Oh, he's got a... something else, huh? See, they have a... Uh, the... what is it? The Queen Breaker's bow? But they're using Sivas like blasts out of it. Wow, I'm a lousy shot. Killed him. What does that area lead to? I wonder if we're going to come back to that. Huh. Damn, I forgot about all this. Super freaking cool. I did what I could to protect their resting place, but I knew what would happen if someone found it. We were touched by the light. I... I didn't even know someone with the Traveler's Gift could die. Until they did. <laughs> That's silly. Find the replicator and deactivate it. Only that will stop the flow of SIVA once and for all. Something just exploded in there. This fire is in a... Oh, shit. That's right. The Iron Lords are in here. I wonder... They're big, though. They're, like, 15 feet tall. They were the size of Saladin. We're, like, just as tall as he is. Are these people big because of their mutations interacting with Siva? Or is there some other weird reason they're so big? It's the flames here. Is this the final mission already? Things on the ceiling. I'm detecting DNA. They're human. Human? That's not possible. Uh-oh. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be this is the final boss fight. Entering self-destruct. <laughs> What's happening? No. It can't be. The axe. Oh shit. Fell winter. You can reignite the axe with the flames, I think, is the idea. Oh, shit. Yep, yeah, we have to beat them all with the axe. See, I can't believe we never got a, an axe as a weapon type. I know one of the supers, I think, for a Titan has it, but... Yeah, just, like, but... Not enough, man. 
Oh shit, get out of there. Uh oh. That's this is a really cool mechanic though. Does it go to a hundred? Stay within the flames area. I wonder if they'll get close enough now. They're staying away. See, this is dope. Come on. Gillian. Oh. Beating their asses. This is one of the raddest boss fights. It's not difficult, but it's rad because this is a different mechanic than we've gotten. We're fighting old Iron Lords. I forgot about this. I mean, I sort of remembered, but I forgot. Like, it didn't register my mind that, hey, like, these are the old Guardian equivalents of back in the day. Which one are you? Oh, Yolder. Stay down, Yolder. Don't we fight all of them, though? It's just those? Young Wolf. Finish this. How? How did you want me to finish it? What do you want me to do? Complete the sequence and destroy the sea replicator. Okay. I still think it's a bad idea. Nice. It's dope as hell. I remember fighting more. I thought we fought more of the more of these guys. Time to run. Do we die if we stay? We need to go very fast. Oh, we do. Yeah, there's a timer. I didn't notice that. Sick. Siva's still out there. I don't... Oh, what was this? Gilder's Helm. That's pretty cool. Take some screenshots. Oh, I haven't seen Lady Effort yet. The SIVA replicator is destroyed. We found this near it. Damn it. Thank you. She would be honored. My brothers and sisters, I will see you again. Someday. You've given them back to me. Is there a reason he couldn't do all this himself? Because that was all fairly easy. Young Wolf's Howl. Approach. Are you, what is this called? It's the exotic there sword. There was a time that only Iron Lords carried these blades. There are many like this in our armory, but this one is new. It is yours, young wolf. You are the first of a new generation. Take your place as an Iron Lord. That's a rad shot. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Iron Lord, baby.
very anticlimactic. There we go. Okay, it must be popping in. The okay. The young wolf's howl. There it is. Nice. The first of the new Iron Lords. Have you opened these? Bro? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is a cool sword. I mean, it wasn't really my thing. I wouldn't replace, I don't know, Ray's Lighter or any of the others for this. Boltcaster I've come to love, and Dark Drinker's always dope. So, time to dismantle this one. I can always recover it if I need to. Heavy power coupling. Oh, there's one. Heavy dismantle, I guess. Oh, I guess you can just dismantle exotics for that uh, that quest to get the uh, sleeper simulant. Well, hello, Lady Guardian. I Don't. congratulate you for stopping the production of SIVA, but we've still got some cleanup to do. Lady Guardian. Take it easy, robot. I congratulate you for stopping the production of SIVA, but we still got some cleanup to do. I've been tracking down some more intel on the Fallen who was pulling SIVA's strings. A zealot named Axis. Yeah, that's the raid boss. You might have slowed him down for, for now, but uh, when you're ready, we need to start thinking about how to stop him for good. I've been tracking down some more intel on the Fallen who was pulling SIVA's strings. A zealot named Axis. You might have slowed him down for now. But when you're ready, we need to start thinking about how to stop him for good. Okay. So I haven't finished that. Why's well, campaign yet? Back out there. Still got some things to do. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like that was kind of a weak closure for Siva. I remember it being slightly more epic, but... Whatever. I will leave it to Shiro to report to the Vanguard the details of what happened here. So, I once thought the story of the Iron Lords was finished. But it seems you have added a new chapter. The Iron Lords are reborn. Quite unexpected. Okay. Something about you, Guardian. You have a habit of being at the center of history. I'll have to keep my eye on you. There is something about you, Guardian. You have a habit of being at the center of history. I will have to keep my eye on you. The Vanguard wants to maintain a constant presence in the Plaguelands. Get down there and show the Splicers you mean business. You have earned the right to prove yourself worthy of the Iron Lord's legacy, Guardian. Farewell, for greater power awaits. Okay, get rid of all this garbage. Thank you. A lot of running back and forth, You've huh? Lifted a great burden off Check, my Guardian. When you can... The splicer threat is escalating. Quickly. You up for another fight, Guardian? Wrath of the Machine raid, baby. Apparently, the disgraced machine priest, Axis, has proclaimed himself the devil's newest archon. He believes Siva is the path towards godhood. And he might be right. Find the splicer's den, Guardian. Kill Axis. That is a lot of quests that just popped up. Keep an eye on the okay, Kovix is Sin. Wait, Bad Blood Mission? Okay. Come to patrols in the Plague Lands. I don't really know if I'm going to do that. We'll see. Wrath of Machine Raid. Artifacts. Noble Deeds Performed. What does that mean? Prove worthy. Wield Iron Powers by performing Noble Deeds in the Plague Lands. I don't know what that means exactly. Is that wielding the axe out there? Because I feel like I've done a lot already. Echoes of the Past. Picking up some odd dreams in the Plague Lands. Complete the anomaly skin patrol near the Archon's Keep. Keeping on that. Get uh, points from kills with void abilities. That'll never happen. Lost and found. I don't really care about that much. The Wolves of Mars. We still have to do that, too. I forgot about doing that one. I just really wanted to kind of run into Rise of Iron. So I skipped out on that. It's just a side thing. Taking on a few different enemies. It's not that big of a deal. But anyway, we'll wrap it up here, though. I think it's a good point for us to stop. We did a lot in this one. This is a big one. Um, we will pick up where we left off in the next episode of our Rise of Iron playthrough. We still have a few things that I want to do campaign-wise before we move on to just, like, knocking out some classic D1 strikes and then getting to the raids. Um, but uh, before we do that, why don't you uh, why don't you show us some love? Hit that like button. Do not uh, forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet already. 
Uh, if you have any feedback for me, leave in the comments section. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Also, don't forget to take a look at the description box. There are some links there that might be of interest to you, one of which is a link to the Mark 9 Community Discord server. If you want to be part of that group, you can chat with me directly. Otherwise, just know that I appreciate you and your time and hope to see you when we continue with more of our playthrough of Destiny 1's Rise of Iron. Remember how it All right, guys. That's it for me. Take care. Be well. See you next time. Rest easy, Radigan.